<laughs> oh, you can still record a video, low network connection. What does that mean? Hey, Facebook, it's your friendly nosy neighbor, Jessica Carden, and Nicole Crosley in the pouch. In the pouch. We are live today here on Facebook, and we are downtown Idaho Falls. And we thought, you know what, let's go take a look at a venue that we've got here locally that maybe many of you haven't seen the inside of. If you haven't been down to the downtown event center or the deck, then you've missed out on a pretty cool well, you haven't missed out, but you haven't experienced yet a very cool venue that it hasn't been open that, lo that long here in Idaho Falls, and it's amazing. So let's go in and take a look at um, what it, oh, Nicole likes us to make sure we have the address, right, Nicole? As does everyone else. Where the heck are you? Where the heck are we? We are at 480 Park. That's on the corner of, let's see, what's this one? That is, that is, I think it's B Street. So I think it's the corner of Park and B Street, but it's 480 Park. So let's go in and take a look. But I think someone just walked in in front of us. So she's gonna be real uncomfortable when I go in there. Okay, we're going in. We're gonna go in, here we go, are we ready? Oh, let me show you here. We've got, so here's the deck. And there's the downtown event center. It's pretty beautiful down here. It's a great day, look at that blue sky. And so let's go in. Oh, if you want to be in the video, would you like to be in the video? See, this Hi. is a poor girl that was like, oh, garbage. No, I, I'm just wondering Hi. if you're recording something. We're right? Facebook living right now. Oh, my goodness. Okay, that's wonderful. <laughs> this is my sister. Hi. This is the trouble. We're the nosy neighbors. Oh, so we're going in to find out more about the deck right now on oh, live. Cool. Are you going in there? I am. I'm going to go find Jake. But oh, well, Jake's about to be on camera. Oh, my goodness. No, he's not. He's going to be here in about five minutes. Oh, is he? Yes. Okay. okay. So you can hang out. Come on in and be a part of nosy neighbors. How about this? I will come back when I see him. I'm gonna okay. trust when I see him come back in now. Alright, perfect. Alright. That's what happens in nosy neighbors. We get caught. Oh here we are. Look at this. A little Oh well hello! So I'm Jessica Carden with the Nosy Neighbors. Can we ask some questions about the deck? Yeah, of course. I'm Chase Martin, I'm the director of the deck. Well, you are the right guy. I am. So how long have you guys been here? So we just opened back in January of this year. January. What was here before? So we, before, this was a vacant lot for about 20, 25 years. It was an old uh, shopping mall. And uh, we completely gutted the place, took out three different ceilings, and this is the finished product. Wow. It's very urban chic, very kind of New York, Soho, lofty. Absolutely. So this is the room. This is the, this is the... This is, this is our main event hall. This is the main event hall. Yep. So what kind of events do you guys have here? Or what kind are you set up to do? Yeah, so we, we hold corporate events, we hold weddings, we hold uh, special occasions such as uh, anniversaries, birthdays, quinceañeras. Uh, we have live comedy the first Thursday of every month. Uh -huh. That's been a huge hit in the community. Uh, we're trying to work on getting some uh, live music in here. We're, oh, yeah. We're hearing from the community. The, that's a that's a big need. So yeah. We're doing our best. So how do they find out if I have a question. Nicole has a question. Nicole, how can I help who you? Who is this guy? Do, who is this guy? Didn't you hear his introduction? <laughs> I'm Chase. I'm the director of the Downtown Event Center. Okay. No, I didn't hear that. Sorry. I'm She's slow. a little slow. Oh, it's, she has it's a hard right. time keeping up. <laughs> this makes for really good live TV when she has to catch up yeah, in the end. Yeah. Reality TV. Yeah, it is. This is reality TV <laughs> at its worst. That is so true. So in this, so you guys, you guys built this. You yes. built this. Yeah. What, what, what came with the idea? Where did you guys come up with the idea? And you're the manager, but who's the owner? So the owner is Jay Durchy. Uh He kind of had... Uh, he was actually trying to rent the space out before he decided to actually move forward with the event center. And uh, he got the idea of creating an event center and kind of ran with that idea. Oh, that's amazing. Yeah, he, he completely did he designed... Did he take any ideas from other places? Like he said, I've been to Dallas and I want to create that in Idaho Falls. Or was it just kind of sure. out of his brain? Yeah, you know, from, from what I understand, it was all Jake's idea from... You know the the beams with the Edison light bulbs into in it to the the rafter that we have holding the projectors. Yeah. The, all the the rafter is all reclaimed wood from the basement. Wow. Yeah. So you, you guys built 
I mean, they built this then Absolutely. from whatever. That is really neat. Yeah. How do they find out what you guys are offering and what, so, or what's coming up here? So anyone that wants to visit our website at thedeck.vip, we have our prices for weddings, uh, corporate events, special occasions. We have our live events on there. Uh, right now we have a singles mingle next Thursday. Ah. Trying to kind of revive the, the singles uh, events in the area. Mm -hmm. I know that singles are kind of starving for uh, some interaction, some actual person to person interaction right. in the falls. Uh, are you going to do speed dating? Possibly. Oh, that we'll, could be we'll, a really we'll, cool we'll, event. We'll see where singles <laughs> night goes. And, speed and dating in Idaho night. Falls. Right. That would be awesome. Yeah. Yeah, it'd be a lot of fun. <laughs> well, so they can go to the deck, D E C dot VIP. VIP. So not dot com, dot right. VIP. Do you guys also do Facebook or any social we media? Do. Yeah, so I have the I have the deck is our Facebook page, mm -hmm. and then downtown underscore event is our Instagram page. Perfect. Yeah. So if they if they want to have an event, so you mentioned having an event and the cost. How much does it cost to rent out the deck? Yeah, so for a weekday day, so that block is from about 6 a.m. to 4 to 5 p.m., that's $800. And then a night weekday block is 1000 That goes from about 5 p.m. to midnight. And then a weekend is $1,500. If you'd like to rent it for the whole day, it's just an additional $400, bringing the total to $1,900. What do you guys offer if they rent? What what do they have? Or do you have tables? Do you have yeah, decorations? So, do you have service? What do you have? Absolutely. So we, we have 24 banquet tables that are 30 inches by 72 inches. We have 24 round tables that are 60 inches around. Uh, we have 192 chairs, uh, 10 cocktail tables, a stage that's about eight feet by 16 feet so fairly large uh, we have a bar area catering area a bride's room two large bathrooms to accommodate the, the 350 person capacity uh, uh, event space mm -hmm. and uh, right now we're, we're kind of in the works with some caterers trying to uh, come up with some easy catering packages to kind of take that headache away from uh, anyone that's booking with us having having to find their own caterers right. and, and deal with that. What about um what about can they, can they break up can they break up the space? Let's see what the space looks like. Can Absolutely. you take like half of it? Oh what yeah. So that? show us kind of what we got. Good yeah. idea, Nicole. So can they break up the space? Yeah, so the fireplace is kind of a our, our natural barrier between one side of the event center and the other side of the event center. Look at those great windows. These these windows open completely up. So during oh, the summer, wow. anyone walking past the event center on a nice day are gonna, is going to see right into the event center. So it's open to the street? Absolutely. Oh, awesome. Matter of fact, why, why don't I show you? How oh, I show. love it. This is probably one of my favorite features of the event center. Such a unique, unique concept. Wow. Look at that, I'm backing up. Look at that. Just like that. Wow, yeah, wow. And then you have easy access to the street. What a cool. Wow. Did you see that, Nicole? Yes, yeah, it's pretty awesome. It makes me think of all the big things that you can drag into that room. Or right. you can kind of fence exactly. off the sidewalk and have like that. Yeah. The, 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 other, the other fun aspect about this is we have four infrared heaters uh -huh. up here. So if you're having, say, a fall heat event, we can turn these heaters on and it, it makes this place very toasty. Yeah, but yet still get to have that outside feel. Exactly. That is an, oh, that is really cool. Yeah. And you guys haven't been open through the summer yet. Not yet. Oh, no one's even seen how amazing this is gonna be. Yeah. Well, that's cool. What else have we got in this space? Yeah, so what, I'll, Nicole? Level. We didn't walk up any stairs. This is street level, yep. but do they have yep. upstairs stuff? So that's kind of one of our future projects. Oh. So we have stairs leading up to a roof access, and eventually that's going to be a rooftop lounge. No, so cool. Yeah, that'd be so, awesome. 
Personally, I don't know any other place in Idle Falls that has a rooftop lounge. No, so no. That, that's a pretty cool uh, little addition that, that we're working on. So speaking of, so let's keep looking around here. So we've yeah. got the lights. We kind of, I like how they've got kind of different sections. Yeah. Your Edison lights, which makes it so neat with the reclaimed wood yeah. and then the fireplace and it gets all roaring as a gas fireplace. Yeah, yeah. It puts off some good heat. So yeah. one of the things that we do when we have comedy night, you know, we're back in 250 plus people in here. So we turn the AC down. Yeah. You know, we don't want it to get too hot in here. So we'll turn the fireplace on and it becomes kind of a, a fun hangout place for yeah. people to kind of balance that, that cool and, and yeah. heat. So, one of the other things you'll notice with these squares is we have different hardwood uh, patterns. So we have this under each of our uh, each of our beams, and then under our main uh, scaffold we have a large dance floor. Oh well. yeah! So you get I, that's a great, you have places for tables, but then you can still have a dance floor for a wedding reception or a. A party, yeah, yeah. yeah, a lot of fun. So fun. So I've noticed you got a lot of the um, the audio visual. So do you guys have a sound system so that if if someone, especially like a meeting, right, they came in and they wanted they have all the stuff set up for a, if it wanted to be a class or a meeting. Right. Yeah. So we have two wireless microphones that are hooked up to three work speakers, and I mean you can easily hear throughout the venue. A lot of times we actually have to turn down the volume mm -hmm. so that we're not blasting the audience. Yeah. Um, and then we have two projectors that you can actually project two different images at one time. So if you want to have, say, a video going on one and a photo loop on the other, or a pre presentation one on, on one and a video loop on the other, we, we can accommodate that. That's amazing. So does it cost extra for audio visual or so sound? Audio visual All included. included. That is really cool. Yeah. So what's the future vision? So what, what Well, let's go. Can we take a walk back and see the, the yeah. catering facility yeah, to walk us by there? So tell us Absolutely. about the future vision yeah, of so, what's going to happen. So, so the rooftop lounge, awesome. Right, yeah. And one of the things that we're, we're really pushing for is for Idaho Falls to have a, a wedding space of its own. You know, mm. a beautiful wedding space that a bride or groom can customize to be their own. Yeah. You know? Um, corporate events are some of our favorite events. Mm -hmm. Just last night, we had uh, the Hustle Project. Yes. Come. Fantastic. They, they get their their uh, dinner with us, and that was a lot of fun. Yeah. But one of the things that we're really excited about is Idaho Falls is starving for a weekday nightlife, mm -hmm. even a weekend nightlife, really. Mm -hmm. Other, mm -hmm. Outside of you know bar hopping, mm -hmm. and, you mm -hmm. know the, the normal uh, nighty things. So. That's why we created Comedy Night, to give someone an alternative that's a family-friendly atmosphere where they can come and enjoy downtown. Yeah. You know, and then, like I said, we're working on bringing in live music to kind of accommodate that that need that yeah. we have for live music yes. in this area. And downtown's such a cool place in the evening. Yeah. I mean, such a cool place. Go and grab dinner at, at any of the many uh, restaurants downtown. And then stop in that gear yeah. and wrap up your night. Awesome. You know? I love that idea. Yeah. So we so, got the, the barn door. You can see that. Love it. Yeah. So we can close the, the catering area off like that. The floors are amazing, by the way. Oh, yeah. Love that. Floor, I mean, hardwood throughout. Yeah. It's Beautiful. Amazing. Yeah. And this is our catering space. So large catering area. You know, we've had quite a few caterers come through and they haven't had any problems being able to fit all their stuff, yeah. all their equipment in here and serve, you know, beautiful dishes. So with this, with catering, you can bring your own caterer. You don't have to use Absolutely. anybody specific. You, anybody can come in for the catering. Absolutely. Awesome. Yeah. What about um, alcohol and drink service? Yes. Do they have to hire someone to come in or do you guys have an idea? Matter of fact, we just had this custom bar built for us. Wow. So this little system here, we display our uh, beverages and it'll light up. Love for, that. For anyone walking up to see what they'd like to order. That's awesome. So we do have a, a beer and wine license and we can serve that ourselves. 
liquor license uh, is something that has to be catered and brought in. Mm -hmm. But, but so if you want a hard awesome. liquor, you've got to find a, someone to come in that will bring it in, but you guys do beer and wine. We do. Love that. Yeah. Very cool. Yeah. And then let, let, let me take you back here to show yeah, you. Yeah, let's look in the back. Yeah, so this is our green look room. Look how amazing that look. Right slash bridal room. Oh. This, and, and this is a personal project that I have going on. So I'm wanting to create a, a very warm, comfortable atmosphere in this bridal room. Oh, look at oh, that. Green. So this is, this is where our comedians come and kind of hang out. You know, this is our backstage. Yeah. Oh, um, yeah. The, the green room of. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Yeah. Got our TV here. Yeah, this is very yeah. green roomy. Exactly. Love that. Yeah. So we, we had plans to put in a, a long countertop under the mirrors for, you know, bridesmaids or if, you know, yeah. comedians. How many outlets are in that room? Say that one oh, that's time. a really good point. You got to know how many outlets because. Yes. You so, know, when you have a bride in here, that's we, key. We do, but we're we're adding more power strips to the to the room so that they will never run out. Yeah, that's you. Yeah. Yeah. Good good thinking on that because that is one you know Absolutely. never enough bathrooms and never enough outlets. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. And the nice yeah, thing yeah. is, is bathrooms are right across from the bride's room, so you know they they never have to worry about. that. I love the mirrors, the the big mirrors. Yeah. I love that. But I mean, I don't know if Facebook can see how amazing. This is amazing. Love the love the theme and the right. invite. Yeah, Which with the Edison carry, light bulbs is awesome. It carries throughout the venue. You know, it's not very. We don't have any disconnect between one room and the next. It, yeah. It's just a, a nice flow of the entire venue. Well, it's amazing. Yeah, we're looking at bringing in more sheet furniture. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, we have plans of building a, a little uh, bar countertop in this corner, mm -hmm. uh, a pedestal for a bride mm -hmm. to stand up on. Mm -hmm. So we really just want to create this this comfortable atmosphere for a bride or for any special guests that we may have coming. That's awesome. Do you have a question, Nicole? She's frozen yeah. up. January was you opened in January? Yeah, just this past January. January. So, what's been the craziest event? I think of oh. like casino night or a high school reunion <laughs> sure. or what's been just the craziest, busiest, most full event you've had? Um, you know, the most full event we've had so far is probably our dry bar comedy. It was so good. Yeah, we so, came to that. Yeah. So good. We we had about three hundred people good. in the venue. Nice. And it was packed. Yeah. I mean, we we and still what's had the maximum capacity. Speaking of three hundred. Yeah. People. So our maximum capacity is three hundred and fifty people. So we were right about there. We, yeah. We had three hundred people. Could still fit a little bit more yeah. in here. Well, it went, and we went to that that event, yeah. and it was awesome. It would have been amazing in the summer with the right. doors open. Absolutely. Oh yeah. Yeah. Yeah, amazing. Yeah. Oh, I love it. So what else, yeah, so we've seen all of, let's take a look, I'm gonna back out here. We've seen all the areas yeah. so that we've the, got. These are our two bathrooms, uh, very large spaces. Very we've cool, got look at that. three stalls in the women's bathroom, a couple stalls in the men's mm -hmm, bathroom. Mm -hmm. you know, never really a line, even with 300 people here. Yeah. They don't, you guys don't happen to have like, Again, this is just a weird add of blue. I'm just thinking of like uh, when they have a high school prom. It yeah. would be a sweet place to have a prom. Oh, that and would be nice. You know, go out and do something crazy, like to go out and horseback ride. You guys don't have to have showers, kind of like a rock <laughs> type of a situation. I don't know if liability-wise you want to let people shower <laughs> in an event <laughs> venue. Yeah, yeah we, we don't have any but showers. I don't... Like, you know, I mean, maybe on a rainy day, they can access our room. <laughs> Get up there and there's your shower. <laughs> yeah, there we that go. That way, I love can that. Can take a look at the roof? Yeah. Oh, let's go take well, a look at the roof. So, the, the, the keys are actually next door. I don't have those on me. Oh, So we, okay. we do have a, a kind of a dead bowl on both sides just oh. to kind of prevent yeah. know, anyone from going in and out. Going in and out. Yeah. Tommy gets to be but in my shot right while now. while we're on a prom, Oh we, yes, we do have Hillcrest prom this this Saturday. So tomorrow. oh, is so it the first prom? That's the first prom. Oh, yeah. that'll be awesome. Yeah, Maybe we'll come down and get some shots of the Halloween. Yeah, yeah. Yes, this would be the coolest place for a prom. Right? Yeah, and then 
two Saturdays oh, from tomorrow, we have Skylines shot, prom. Put on the Facebook. Oh, yeah. yeah. So we got a couple proms two proms. Today. Yeah. Well, I mean, yeah. Well, I mean, if you think about where is else it, would you go for a cool spot, yeah. it's the gym. I mean, right. well, very cool. And we got the Center Theater right across yeah. the street, Pops Ice Cream right across the street, you know, all the restaurants that yeah. they can go to for dates. I mean, this is a perfect spot it in is. town to have a prom. It is perfect. And they don't have to decorate. Yeah. This is already decorated. Yeah. You know? Yeah. It is really perfect. Yeah. So tell us one more time. How do we find out more about what's coming up? Yeah. And if we want to rent, where do we go? Okay. So you can visit us at I Have the Deck on Facebook, downtown underscore event on Instagram, or the deck, T H E D E C dot V I P for our website. All right. I have a last question. This is on everybody's minds. All right. 350 people, how will they park down here? Okay. Because that's the big question, right? Uh, Everyone thinks there's no parking. Parking is no. a myth. Let me just say that right uh -huh. now. So both paid parking lots, we validate. So you don't have to worry about too many fighting for too many parking spots. So we got paid parking on Capitol and B Street. Which we, is just one, like yeah, one block up. Not even that, half a block. Yeah. Maybe. I mean, it's, it's about a hundred yards. We walk further walking into the mall in the parking lot than we would for that. Yeah. The other paid parking lot we have is right behind Idaho Mountain Trading, and there's always plenty of parking there. Yeah. That one is probably about a block away. Yeah, so, still not very long. If anyone yeah. has ever lived anywhere, it's very close parking right. everywhere yeah. it is. Yeah. yeah. Most people could walk from Dillard's to Macy's, yeah. and that's about double the distance between yeah the parking in Idle Mountain Parking or Idle Mountain Trading here. Yeah, yeah, it is, yeah, that is that is very true. You've got great parking very close. Yeah. So don't think that there isn't great parking, because there is. And after six, everywhere downtown is free. Yeah. You know, I mean, you can pay, you can park on the street and you don't have to worry about getting a ticket after yeah. six. Yeah, that's awesome. Anything else we need to know that we don't know about the deck? Let's go take a look at that roof. You know what? Yeah. Come June 6th to our next live comedy, we got Andy Gold. He's one of the most coveted comedians on the Dry Bar Tour. Mm -hmm. He's hilarious. June 6th, June Andy 6th. Gold, where do they, they get tickets on Eventbrite? Yes, so you can go on Eventbrite, you can go on our website, thedeck.vip, and, uh, or our Facebook page. And either of those three sites, you can purchase tickets. I love that, yeah. that's awesome. All right, you guys, this is an amazing venue. You, if you haven't been down, you gotta come down and take a look at how amazing and beautiful this venue is. I'm gonna go like this here. Oh, see if I can get it switched down. So you guys, come down, down, come down to the deck. It's again, it's on Park, between Park and B. Park on um, right up the street, come down and see it. It's amazing. Um, the deck, the Downtown Event Center, find them on Facebook. Have an event here. This has been the Two Nosy Neighbors. She's asleep, there she is. Two Nosy Neighbors, Hi. Jessica and Nicole keeping you in the know.